What's up, Scuba Squad? It's your boy, Scuba Steve Oz Aquatics. Coming at y'all with a little unboxing I got from Lefty and Higer. Let's see what we got in these boxes. Um, I know one thing was a heater. I opened it already because I needed it. And I'm not gonna do a review on something that I haven't used yet, you know what I'm saying, so, ooh, that hurt my finger, so I'm gonna use the heater for a few days, and I'm gonna come back and do a review on that, but, ah, oh, nice, nice little click okay thing, <coughs> that's pretty nice. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Higer. Focus on aquariums always. Create a mysterious underwater world. Change your aquarium into a beautiful and comfortable scenery with Higer products. So let's go on and cut this little tag over here. We're gonna Go ahead and swap the camera around real quick. Right. Got the tag off of this thing. It's pretty cool. Broken down log looking thing. So, I think he's pretty big enough to fit in here. What do y'all think? And then I got the little pleco under here. I'm gonna put this thing in this tank. So, I'm gonna go ahead and get my hand in here. Oh. Even out some of this sand from this digging old parrot. I can grab this old thing up. Get him in there. I think we'll set that just like that. That looks pretty cool. Somewhat. But. Oh, it's pretty cool. Looks even better once you get it in there. I right, appreciate it, Lefty, my guy. Tiger. Thanks for the heater. I actually have the heater in here. I'm treating this guy with some melt fix and some aquarium salt. But this is for another video. But I'll give y'all a sneak peek. My guy got messed up on the way home from Aquatic Con. He didn't do too hot. So, got him some melt fix and some salt today. Lefty. Your quarries are doing really good, and I'm starting to fall in love with them, so you might not get these back, my guy. No, I'm just kidding. But yeah, they're doing pretty awesome. I'll do a little water change, suck up all this old food, and fill this tank up, fill this tank back up all the way, and then let him get treatment for a week or so but yeah this is another video like i said but i got the higher heater in in here with him this is why i already opened it as you can see it's been working pretty awesome it's got these four little oops suction cup things so, let's show y'all these. Uh, one just came off. See the end floats. I don't like how the end is like got a buoyant, buoyancy and it just tends to float from the bottom. Then you put a rock in there and make it sink or something. But anyways, like I was saying, you got these suction cups that you slide into these little holes. 
So what I do, I just suction it to something, and then I just give it a good push and a little twist, snap it right in place. Oh, that wasn't working too well. Ugh. So, just, oh, I can't really see that well. Slide it in there. Oh, missed. And then give it a little twisty twist. The old twist and pull, you know? The old twist and pull. All right, the old twist and pull. All right, once you get all four of these things on for the heater, you'll just snap the heater in place right here like so and then get it in place see without the suction cups so feeling it this part is it hot so i'm gonna snap it on there suction it in place and another good thing i like about it you might not be able to see because I'm on the bubbles. Let me unplug this for a sec. Just to give you a better visual of it. They don't have numbers on the top. But a good thing is it's got the light on it that lets you know that it's on. And it's got a... What do you call it? Thermometer built in to it in Celsius and Fahrenheit so that's pretty cool and it says for household use only do not operate dry made in China high your aquarium 60 Hertz 50 watt heater so yeah, I appreciate it, Lefty Tiger. Shout out to y'all. And then this poor guy, we'll leave him alone. Can y'all see his sides beat up a little bit? I had to get a spare heater and get in there with him. So I went ahead and opened it for because it was an emergency. I, he was like getting beat up in the main tank once I got him back in yesterday. He wasn't doing too well, so I went ahead and pulled him out of there and got him into this quarantine tank so I can get his sides fixed up. His eyes are a little cloudy from the show. So I'm just going to go ahead and treat him with this salt and this smell of fix. But yeah. I uh, appreciate it, Lefty, once again. Appreciate it, Higer. And that's it. That's the two things I won from the stream. Hope y'all enjoy this content. Hit that like, hit that bell, hit that subscribe button if you want to be a Scuba Squad member. Yep, so all you got to do is hit that subscribe button to be in the Scuba Squad. Once again, thank y'all. Peace out, Scuba Steve-O. See y'all later. Okay, so look, y'all. I didn't even realize, look. The knob goes up and down when you twist it. Look. The little orange thing goes up and down. So you can mark and pinpoint what temperature you want, you know? So, I'm going to go about 82 some, Somewhere between 82 and 84 or something like. Uh oh. I can't see it. Oh. Take about 80 to 80.